Hey guys, Dracovich here. Today I wanted to go over the new defense missions and the terminated plans. They can be a bit difficult, so I wanted to go over my strategies for doing them, so maybe I can help you guys. So I decided to take the EMS mortar, regular mortar, the rocket sentry, and the auto cannon. And I placed the auto cannon and the rocket sentry up on the stairs so they would have a good line of sight for when the wild titans come. And you can place your mortar sentries anywhere really. I suggest putting them back behind this door even though I put it in front of this door for this round. Because eventually they will get up to this point where I'm at right now in the video. And they'll start attacking and you're going to want to push them back down through the gate. So I just wanted to show you the turrets in action. This is only the first round. We're going to go to a higher round in a second. So here we're on round 7 out of 8 and you can see that there's a lot more enemies coming. The auto cannon really puts in work for the bile titans and the rockets are really good for taking out the smaller enemies and also helping with the bile titans. While, this was, while my turrets were shooting I was also throwing stun grenades over the wall at the enemies to hold them in place until the mortars could start firing at them. I feel like this helped a lot. You could also bring something like a spear or a recoilless rifle or eat it instead of a rocket sentry so that you can fire at the ball titans yourself. I didn't have any support weapons during this round, but it didn't really matter. It might be better than the rocket sentry. Let me know in the comments below how you guys beat this mission. And we can see here at 18% of the mission time remaining. We got full experience, full stars, full requisition on Helldive. Eight medals. I want to thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, it really helps the channel out. And I'll see you guys next time.